The Lady and the Gentleman Are Dead The days of the lady and the gentleman have long been over. Gone are the days of chivalrous actions, like young men walking young women to class, men holding doors open for women, or even opening the car door for a woman to get in. The lady and the gentleman are dead. There was once a time when a woman was a lady, when her virtue was a thing to be cherished, but now our young girls have fallen to the fits of folly, kissing one young man goodnight while another young man awaits her company. Again, I say, the lady and the gentleman are dead. Gentlemen used to be held to a standard, a fierce thing to behold. But now our young men have retarded to disrespectful boys, with their pants sagging low, sleeping with as many girls as possible to fulfill their self-worth, but spreading disease while acting ignorant of their status. The lady and the gentleman are dead. Young girls slash your tires and bust the windows out your car. Stand on your front lawn shrieking about the chick on your Instagram that you said was your friend or your cousin when you knew that she wasn't, and you wonder why she's mad. The lady and the gentleman are dead. Little boys throw up gang signs, swear to rep their set till they die, bodies lie in the street outlined in chalk, with the parameter of yellow caution tape keeping the family back, because your boys and them sold you out and lied. But y'all still proclaim that it's them girls who ain't loyal when in fact, the lady and the gentleman are dead. Let's see if we can't resurrect them one more time. Let's see if males and females can raise their little boys and girls to become ladies and gentlemen once again. It is my prayer that they can.